Right guys, welcome back to the channel again today. Today we've got a feature day, as you can see. Uh, before we get over and meet Chris, the owner of this lovely uh, Astra VXR, um, basically doing features as well. So if any of you want to do a, a cool feature of your car, or if you've got some mad builds or anything, drop us an email, let us know, and we'll try and sort something out. But right, let's head over and meet Chris, the owner of this lovely car. Uh, hello Chris, thanks for coming down today and uh, letting us look over this lovely Astra uh, VXR you got here. Tell us a bit about it and what you've done to it. No worries, how you doing guys? Uh, thanks for having me back on the channel again. No problem. Um, yeah, so <clears throat> as uh, Vinny mentioned before, we've had quite a bit of work done uh, to the engine, four, uh, running 404 brake uh, at the moment. Um, yes, there is more coming. Um, but yeah, so obviously when I first bought the car, uh, yep. Should run a shell uh, on the connecting rod and the uh, crank. Yeah. Um, so tickety boom, we had to uh, get the engine all taken out, rebuilt. Um, yeah. And Vinny said he'll he'll be more than happy to get the uh, the build done. Yeah. But uh, of course we needed to do it the proper way. So yeah, we got it sent off to Gibbs Motorsport. Um, work done there by uh, lovely Ash. He also had it. Uh, we had the bottom end sent off to R&D, get the version 2 uh, wedging and uh, Decked. decking done. Yeah. And uh, yeah, and then we went, uh, we decided to go bigger bore, go for the bigger uh, Vosner pistons. So it's fully forged. Yeah. Um, we had the head uh, ported as well. Um, yeah, and just uh, some extra bits running the KRS Stage 3 uh, turbo. Uh, we've got the 90 mil uh, intake program. Um, yeah, a couple of uh, various other bits uh, put onto the car. Uh, got a custom exhaust as well. I am running. Yeah, the exhaust is uh, fully customized, uh, three inch from uh, from front to back. Two resonators uh, just to keep the noise levels, you know, a little yeah. bit, a little bit down. Respectable, had, yeah, that's it. Had the neighbours shouting. <laughs> that's it. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, no, it's obviously impressive power figures that uh, the turbo pulled through um, when we had uh, yeah, yeah. Got the mapping done. What, what sort of uh, suspension setup have you got, or is it all completely standard at the moment? Because understanding that you haven't had the car for long and that you're open to more things to be done to it, uh, performance parts fitted soon, so that's going to be another thing coming up. But just run us through like the wheels, brakes, and uh, what other kinds of uh, things you've done to it, if you have. Sure, so currently still got uh, standard brake set up. Um, okay. Obviously, that will be uh, on the on the to-do list right at the top. Of course, needs some uh, good stopping power. Um, you know, with the power that the car has. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> we, uh, when we had it matched, you didn't expect it to be that sort of power, did you? Really? No. Nah. It, it was quite shocking, really. So yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, as you can see, guys, this is uh, such a lovely example of a car. It's very clean. It's got lots of potential uh, for it. Um, uh, have you got the rear anti-roll bar on there yet? I don't have the rear anti-roll no. bar just yet. No, it's still, again, um, I put a lot of money that, uh, you know, that, that I was going to do, you know, to, to add extra bits I had to put yeah. into the engine to get rebuilt. So. That's right, yeah. So it was performance first over than <laughs> anything else, basically. Yeah. Well, I just wanted running, mate, really. That's it, running properly, yeah. But, yeah, no, so yeah. I mean, the only reason why I built it that way is so that, you know, eventually the car is actually going to come off. I mean, yeah. Like Garrett, big turbo. Uh, but this again will um, will be added after all the other bits get put onto the car. You know, okay. it's running sweet at the moment, so. Yeah. You know, we'll just be happy to, um, yeah, you know, just add the extra yeah. bits on it and then. Add you know, as you go along. So it, it. Ma it makes it your unique mm. build, mm. so to speak. Yeah. But yeah, um, what lights are they on the back there? So we've got DNAs um, on the back. Bought those pretty much straight after I got the car. Okay. Um, always thought those look mega. Um, yeah, always, you know, seen a couple of VXRs come past. I just and thought, yeah. I've got to have them. <laughs> it is a must, it must have sort of thing to yeah. have on these. It does set the back end off. Exhaust system there, the, yeah, as so, you were saying. Yeah, so back. as I said, it was a, a straight through um, uh, a three inch, but uh, it's a custom, custom to four inch pipe, which, I mean, the previous owner had uh, put onto the car, so yep. you know, eventually I'll get it changed, um, or I might even just get it molded to sort of the shape of the bumper. That's um, it. Yeah, heated up and, and pressed in. Yeah. Yeah. 
and um, yeah, we've gone through the brakes, tyres, we've got the P7 Pirellis on there, yeah, as you can back. see. Um, the interior is pretty much stock at the moment, but it has got some nice hydro dipped uh, bits on it, like the handles, <laughs> it's got <laughs> the... McDonald's packets. Yeah, That's it's got the custom. side, uh, inside the uh, centre console bit all done and dipped, as you can see. But I see you've got some boost gauge and the uh, oil temp uh, gauge yeah, uh, there. Yeah, just the, the Pro Sport uh, uh, gauges, which I will um, eventually change. Yeah. Yeah, just something a little bit more. Uh, how can we put it? Reliable? That's it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I'm, I'm liking the fact that you've actually pretty much from the engine, it's pretty much stock, isn't it? I mean, it's it's your blank canvas for your your build and how you want the car to be, yeah. really, yeah. isn't it? So, I mean, obviously, we're running the standard brake setup at the moment, as you can see, but that will be up, upgraded very soon, basically, uh, to how Chris wants it. Have yeah. you thought about what sort of upgrades you're gonna have for the brakes? Well, um yeah, I've, I've thought about, you know, I do like the way the Brembo's look, um, you know, there are a yeah. couple of other options out there, but yeah, I thought, you know, instead of just, you know, putting money to something and then needing to upgrade it again later on, you might as well just go full send, you know, maybe get some eight pots on, um, yeah. you know, you need the stopping power so you <laughs> feel confident. Yeah, yeah, um, especially in this. <laughs> exactly. Because uh, uh, off the car, uh, I have been in this myself. So right, we're going to crack on, uh, we're going to go for a little drive in this lovely little uh, beast here. Just out of curiosity, how long have you had the uh, car for? Uh, so I bought her um, 2022, around about uh, August time. Yeah. So yeah, just over a year now. I've only been driving it for <laughs> yeah for a month or so since uh, we had it rebuilt. Um, right. Okay. But yeah, no. Uh, what do we? We think we've done about 1,300 miles now. Okay. Yeah. Since it's yeah. been rebuilt. Yeah. 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 So, yeah, right, loving every moment though, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Um, yeah, I get, a bit, I get a bit nervous. Oh, actually, go, yeah, go down there, give us, give us a little uh, pull of it, see what it's like. Right, so. Low boost. Definitely got some tug in it. Yeah, she likes to step, doesn't she? Yeah, yeah. Um, let me close the window so we can. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah. Hear us talking a little bit better. Uh, yeah, I just love that blow off. You know, the, uh, it's such a sweet sound. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do, I do, I do miss the old uh, noises they make from the KR fills. Especially when you've got a good induction K uh, on them. Yeah, I mean, you could be pretty naughty, you know, get into a, um, a, a park, you know, parking lot somewhere, go yeah. to Tesco's parking lot, and you, yeah, you can, uh, you can see on. the frightening look on some people's face. <laughs> it does pop, did it? <laughs> uh, yeah, definitely puts a big smile on my face. <laughs> I bet it does. Yeah, I bet I mean, it as does. you can see from the uh, from the mapping video, I mean, I think it was more you know nerves and um, and excitement all mixed in one. But yeah, yeah, Whew. yeah, she can pull uh, pull on the nerves. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> but so, have you got any other plans? What was your next first um, modification going to do? So I think the next one. You know, um, I don't usually drive it too hard. Uh, yeah. Of course, you know, um, the brakes aren't, uh, aren't, you know, they're still standard. They're not great, so. are they on standard? No, they? but I mean, you know, if you're driving normally, they're fine. They're yeah. not bad, they really aren't bad. But uh, I think, yeah, just in terms of uh, more stability and handling, I want to go rear anti-roll bar. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, because I, I do believe those are, are you know, SST, yeah. absolute Keep major difference in, in handling. So yeah, yeah. You know, just to reduce that body roll at the back, um, going into corners and that, you know, I'll feel a little bit more confident. Um, in, in it and stepping out and that, yeah. yeah in the dry weather anyways. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And they, 
they do handle very nice, but especially when you do put the rear anti-roll bars on them. Yeah. They really do handle so much nicer than that. So yeah, so you you were saying as well off camera that you're thinking of <laughs> oh, you're thinking of going for a, um, a bigger turbo upgrade than that. Yeah, I will. Um, you know, when you said that we needed to rebuild the engine, um, yeah, that's when I initially said, well. You know, we're gonna have to just go, you know, go big or go home. Uh, really. Yeah, that's uh, it. So yeah, just uh, built it the way she is at the moment, so she can take max whatever you throw at it, really. Yeah. So yeah, yeah I do. I want to go big power, um, yeah. which will be the next step. I'm not sure when. Um, you know how it is with family and finances. And, yeah, you know, as just, they are. Yeah, we just bought <laughs> a, a house now as well, so you know, mortgages. Yeah. Through, yeah. uh, Unfortunately, it's number one. Over the car, yeah. <laughs> that's it, exactly. <laughs> yeah, that's why I, I got all mine out of the way, got all my stuff out of the way quick. Yeah. But, um, yeah, so no, it's, it, it really does feel nice in here, though, doesn't it? It's, yeah. It, like you say, it's got the six speed gearbox and that. You, you're saying about that you're going to upgrade the clutch as well soon, as well. Yeah, so I <laughs> uh, forgot, forgot to mention that one in the beginning there. Um, yeah. But, yeah, standard clutch, so. The amount of uh, power putting down, she actually can't hold it. Um, if you right. put your flat, uh, foot flat, sorry, uh, through first, second, yeah, clutch can't hold it at all. Um, oh. she, yeah, she limits straight away. Okay. Um, so yeah, you have to just sort of feather the, you know, feather the throttle a little bit just to um, get, get it going. To, to yeah, get it to bite. So but it's not too bad. <laughs> Yeah, it's mad, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, the clutch, so you can hear it screaming uh, for help. And I'm joking. Uh, <laughs> but, Jenna, we'll uh, upgrade it to, um, yeah, paddle, uh, light and flywheel, etc. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, but uh, in time. I think yeah. for now, I'm just going to enjoy it a bit more. That's you know, it. While I, while I get uh, other preferences out of the way. Yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah, and we'll, um, you know, we'll, we'll definitely work on it. So I'm sure we'll get more videos out there. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, You'll have to have you back on the show and uh, <laughs> see what it's like with a bit more upgrades, really. Yeah, no, definitely, mate. Yeah. Yeah, if you want to give it some pulls and that. I mean, it's a second gear pull, guys. It does get up and go, doesn't it? It's, yeah. it's that third gear as well. Once it hits third gear, it's, it gets grip and goes, doesn't it? That's it, yeah. I mean, uh, one thing I really do enjoy about the turbo is that she eats the rev range. The, yeah. The, the, the boost just keeps on going right through. There's no, there's no, no drop off. In, no dropping off, yeah. That's it. There's no, no needing to, to change gear when, you know, yeah, when it sort of reaches that peak. Um, yeah. Yeah, it just pulls all the way through, so. <laughs> no, it does. Oh, it's beautiful. It, oh, it definitely does pull, definitely. Wow. It's that noise as well, like, Chah! Yeah. <laughs> really does pull like a train doesn't it that 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 second in third gear once it catches that grip it, it does pull off doesn't it it's like you've been catapulted yeah <laughs> and like you, you see that guy looking past like <laughs> yeah 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 <laughs> but no it drives really well doesn't it yeah. it really does uh -huh. steam train yeah definitely oh man but yeah, no, I'm pretty stoked with it actually. It's uh, done you proud, isn't it? Really? Hey, you should be very proud, mate. You've done such a beautiful fucking job. Yeah, well. The amount of work that you've put into this, and you know, it's not only that, mate. It's not just like, oh, uh, you know, the work's done, cheers. Cool. Moving along. Cool. You know, it was just. That noise, I just love that noise. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful noise, amazing. Yeah, it's just you know the amount of work that you did. You know, you didn't just push it out the door and say cheers. You know, yeah. The, you know, if there were any, you know, any little hiccups or anything along the way, you know, you made sure to. Oh yeah, you know, yeah. Well, that's the way you do it. Check it? it all over. You know, check it all over again. Weeks later, check it over. You know, again. Yeah. 
beautiful. I mean, you know, we have this Ferrari behind us. You probably want to race us now. Oh, we'll, we'll leave him. <laughs> we'll smoke him. <laughs> What's that, California, is it? Yeah. <laughs> I'll leave all uh, Chris's links in, his, uh, in the description for his uh, Instagram and that. Go over to him, give him a follow um, and have a chat with him or whatever. But yeah, right guys, I'm going to end it on this one. Uh, thanks for joining us on this uh, first feature. Hope you all enjoyed it. Uh, hopefully it's something that everybody might get involved with and want done for their self. But yeah, until the next one guys, have a good one. Don't forget to smash the like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching and catch you on the next one. Thanks guys. Cheers.